Hello and welcome to Hot Topics Wednesdays. Today, I'm going to talk about some free iPad apps that you can use in your classroom. And I got this information from personal experience and uh, from talking to colleagues and also from the conference Colica where I went recently. So today we're going to talk about five must-have iPad apps for any subject. So number one, organize. You can use uh, for organization, you can use iStudious Pro. Um, this app allows you to create any type of schedule, um, also keep track of grades and GPAs, create, create several summaries, also have assignment reviews and synchronize your uh, calendar with other devices. Uh, you also can have an interactive calendar and different types of notifications. For those who like um, to take notes or doodle or draw or write to organize their thoughts, you can use Penultimate because um, this app transfers everything you write into uh, several notebooks with unlimited amount of pages. A nice app for collaboration is iBooks Author. You can create a collaborative book project with your students where they create together a book or a textbook. Uh, they can choose among different types of templates and insert any form of the media in this book. Of course, any student needs to memorize uh, something for a test or for their, for their class. And um, Flashcard Study Helper is a great app that allows uh, students to create flashcards. You can also share these cards with your friends. And you can also create these cards directly in your iPad. You can use any type of uh, images and mix and match cards. And uh, for example, you can create different lists of cards. You can tag some, I don't know, Spanish vocabulary or physics, and the cards will be kept that way. Um, you can also preview and skim your cards and repeat whatever you didn't get right. And you can also have a test mode where at the end of your test, um, you're given a score. So in order to showcase students' work, you can use Three Ring app. This app allows you to transfer students' work from traditional to digital format and create uh, digital portfolios, share different examples, and use it as formative assessments. Now, I'm sure that you know of many more apps that we can use together. So please share your recommendations in the comments below. And if you like this post, please click like and share it with your friends and your colleagues. And also join me on other social networks. If you're not on my list yet, please come to my blog at www.wiredatheart.com and subscribe to receive free weekly updates and also a free gift. And have a wonderful day. Conquer that distance.